from this next year and yeah. maybe even the year after that. But right now, you, there are some growing pains. But ultimately, they've been pretty solid for a young quarterback. Second down and 10. A quick pass here. They'll get it to King. You can't let him do that. And gone. You can't let him do that. See ya. 80 yards, second play of the game. And we could be in some, some fireworks tonight. And that's what Tyree King can do. He can take nothing or something very small and turn it into a explosive play in a hurry. I mean, this is the most simple route, simple pitch and catch, and then he just goes, okay, you're going to be that far off of me, see you. Yeah, it's a speed right there. They use him as a decoy to run the football to take some pressure off of McIntyre. They will go shotgun, and McIntyre will take a shot. Are we going to have this kind of game? All the way past midfield, down the sideline, turn it on the Jets, fireworks galore. 180-yard touchdown for Catholic, 180-yard touchdown for VA. Settle in. This one could be fun. Keyshawn Bowman, 80 yards, catch and run. Nice throw by George, and then fantastic after showing the speed. Just a sophomore, this kid is fantastic for a 2027. Yeah. Good throw, good catch and stride, good protection up front. A two-play drive, a one-play drive, and be in, in and out of the lineup as well. Leader for that defense. Tyreek King was literally 10 yards behind the safety. Yeah, he was. The throw was on, walk-in touchdown for sure. So it, it worked again. We'll just keep taking shots. We'll just keep taking shots to Tyreek King, who makes the catch at the 35, down to the 31. This game is like going to the arcade and going to the pinball machine. Well, he, he's playing basketball right there, Austin. He's got the yeah. inside leverage. He's boxing out the defensive back who, in first sight, looked like he had some interference there. Uh, mm. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Making the catch through the pass interference. Uh -huh. First down and 10. Hey, our first run of the night. And it goes for about three yards, and the clock's actually going to do something it hasn't done so far, and that is run. run. Yeah, Matthew Rogers here getting the handoff, a freshman here for Knox Catholic. The three spot. Still a lot of football to play, but that's what it looks like now. Bartholomew has time. Well, he did have time. Now, flag is going to come down. You almost hate the big guy being penalized on the interior line. It's like Jason Witten that time against the former Washington Redskins. He lost his and he kept running downfield. Bartholomew looked to throw. Oh, oh, yeah, that's oh, the Joe good. Newrick collision Three. of the year right there. Joe Newrick collision oh, of the year. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> on Bowman. Let's go ahead and run the animation, guys. This is it. Yeah, let's get it out of the way. On offense and on defense. That's Bowman. a body breaker. Woo. It was a gain of six, though. So a second down and four. Kudos to him for holding on. Yeah, Johnson held on to the football. And we held on. They'll look to throw. Quick pass to the outside. Turn towards the end zone. Carry defenders. And he'll call him out inside the one. First down and goal inside the Maybe one. Maybe not. Oh, he Ball's loose. Ball. Ball. Drops the football, and B.A. comes with the turnover. Wow. B.A. has had a couple of huge hits. Jordan Phillips with the return. That ball was jarred loose. Well, we already gave up the Joe Newbert collision of the game, and for, for good reason. But this one right here was a pretty good shot in and of its own right. And it came in a huge spot, obviously, at the one-yard line as Rodgers, you see, going left right here. and Ball, helmet, and out. Wow. Good job of coming up and plugging the hole for Coleman Kalmus. Man, wasn't there a Kalmus that played line? So one play for B.A., an 80-yard touchdown. Let's see what uh, G-Mac and the offense do here. They'll run off right tackle. And pick up uh, three, maybe four yards. Coordinator in four years. A whole lot of change for him throughout his, his high school journey and his senior years, no exception. Well, let me correct myself. Seven touchdowns because he had the one already. Has some time here. Zings this one out. And you, and you see the all. But a third down and five. This Catholic kind of escape from the turnover into the end zone to stop here. They like and play he, action out of this under center stuff. Quick pass to the outside. Oh, look at the cut to the outside. And he will get the first down. Was dead to right on a third down and five. Made a cut to the outside. 
first down and 10. Almost to midfield. Play fake. Pass to the outside, and a quick game of seven. So a lot of shots early on in this football game, a little bit. And they'll play fake here. This is the seven-step drop. He's going to take a shot deep. Under throws the receiver just a bit, but comes back to make the catch back at the 17-yard line. That a pretty catch for Keyshawn Bowman. We're just past halfway to the first quarter. 30 yards on the completion into the D1 red zone down to the 16. McIntyre, play fake, has all kinds of time, throws this one out, and a catch is made down at the nine yard line for a gain of seven. It's that guy. And at that left tackle position, he is a hoss. Second down and three, inside handoff, and they will get the first down inside the five. Give it to the fullback right there. That was Gavin Shea. No complaints here. Eighth play of the drive. Handoff off left tackle. Has blockers in front. Touchdown. Really nice job of following his blockers in front was Arquez Fontenot, the junior for the touchdown, and B.A. with a 13-7 lead. Simple. Get that fullback out there leading the way, and that tackle gets out there. Makes a fade. Neil will get a look here. Neil would have been the starter, but he's had some uh, injury issues. And so they were going to play two tonight. Throw this one out to Tyreek King. Makes a move for three. And out past the 30 for a quick first down. In my opinion. Inside handoff on first down and just a couple of yards. Tennessee certainly sees him that way. Senior starting for Catholic, so well they'll have that machine rolling next year. Second down and eight. Neil looks left, gonna take a shot deep. Why not? Turn it on the jump. Wow, what a oh, catch. What a catch. catch. Oh my goodness. The it's, body control. Yeah, it's not just the speed with this guy. I mean, the body control to come up with that catch. Oh, like, like the vending machine here. Look at him just go over the helmet here. Hey, Casey Funderburg, you're down there. How impressive is this kid? I mean, he got to work, went to some seven on seven camps, and he was able to really up his game. And I think we're seeing that tonight. Yeah, I think we are. Good gravy, to say the least. So far for Tyree King against Kassan Bowman of Brentwood Academy. Second down and fourth, the 14. Oh, look out here. Yeah. Catholic quarterbacks got to be <laughs> careful leading, leading their players right into some big hits. Yeah. And get Brentwood Academy, man. They're coming downhill. Yeah, they are in coming downhill. Hurry. I, yeah, it, it's far, far from over. Yeah, but the way these points are being thrown up on the, on the board. As Jaden Neal has come in at quarterback right across the middle, that'll be a first down inside the five. <laughs> They almost have Neil kind of just coming back. How much do they want him to run? And they'll pitch this one out. And boy, the BA defense in the backfield, just as you guys called, he's to Gavin Menard, the senior. Snap is back, gets this one up. It is good, no flags. 14 10, the 23 yard field goal cuts the BA lead. To four. Second. Just because it's not what they'll do, but it's what I do. Second down and 20. Two receivers near side, nobody to the top of the screen. So they'll throw that way. A little screen pass, Good and play. they'll lose more yardage in that. These two guys, Bartholomew. Bartholomew's done well. Bartholomew, the younger of the two, just a sophomore. They'll start at the 40-yard line. Just getting started in the second quarter. Bartholomew throws this one out. Tyreek King cuts back inside to the outside. Football comes loose, or was he down? They'll say second down. Second down and six. B.A. brings pressure. Bartholomew, he is under duress, and the Eagles will come up with the turnover at the 38-yard line. That time. Yeah, B.A. sent everybody, and it was a jailbreak. Well, that's, that's not who you want to leave unblocked, right? No, it's not. And that time, 
Shivers' recovery actually counted, <laughs> unlike last time when he didn't have a helmet. Yeah, Gavin Schaefer went right through that B-gap. Play fake and take that shot. Got a pretty good quarterback, but they'll hand off off right tackle, getting to the outside. Boy, nice moves there. Close to first down yardage, however, it appears that first down and 13 out at the 42. So this time G-Mac will throw, and they'll get that yardage back down to the 35. That's so far, and a third down and nine coming up for B.A. here as G-Mac under duress going to be taken down at midfield. The Irish decided to send the house after George McIntyre, and they got him. Dadabo back there for the sack, along with a couple of other fighting Irish. And just nowhere to go. 55, so I still have, you know, I still pay for, like, you know, regular TV. Yeah, yeah, nobody does that anymore. Well, we do. <laughs> First down and 10, handoff up the middle. <laughs> Looks like Jaden Neal back in there at quarterback. Second down and 6.43. Neal, the quarterback, has some time, throws this one out, and they'll get the first down, reaching down to the foot. A year ago, I remember the night before Tennessee opened in Virginia, we were over at VA watching McIntyre, and Hypo was on the sideline that night. Throw across the middle, catches, made first down. Guys in his face, Schaefer again, untouched, coming right up the middle on the blitz. You had Neal standing in, throwing right where he left over the middle of the field. Yeah, it's a great read. Yeah, for the first down. And those are the kinds of things that Shadowin said the difference made. Yeah. Three, re the three receivers top of the screen. Jaden Neal going to go to the near side. Single coverage, very well covered. Interception. Came up with it, picked off at the three. Could have gone either way, but the defender pulls that one away. And give credit right there to Isaiah Williams. Now BA's, let's see if they do something here to uh, get themselves a little breathing room. They've had a couple of holding calls, so if you drop back now and get a holding call, you're looking at safety. That's when you need to get a hat on a hat and run the football. They'll go jet sweep here. Ball out to three, they'll Linda get a little ball, bit of breathing ball, room. Ball, ball has got out. it. It is a fight for the football down at the nine-yard line, and Catholic comes up with it. Xavier Bowman on the recovery. They just go this simple end around here, sweep motion to Bowman, and he loses it right there, runs in the back of a Catholic defender and kind of loses it. Zone back there behind the end zone. Second down and nine, they'll pitch this one out. And B.A. in the backfield again. Boy, that guy has been in the backfield all night long. Todd Hammond, number 76. And yeah, nowhere to go. He does a great job seeing it's a sweep action, getting up field. Make on here actually moved it up a couple yards to the spot. Third down. And it'll bring up another field goals in the last quarter or so. Well, I mean, both teams have kind of been bending but not breaking turnovers at bad spots, but yet the other team has really not cashed in in a big way. For a 14-13 game and a right to left. Little draw makes it 14-13. Head down to Casey Fender. Doll at uh, Disney. <laughs> I mean, he got me in that car and said, hang on. And I was sick by the time we got to the end of the street. Turning on the Jets to the outside, all kinds of blocking, cutting back to the inside. Look out here, got a block in front. And so See ya. All the way for the touchdown goes Neo Clifton. And talk about making the defense sick. 95 yards for the Eagles. And I believe there's going to be a, a crack back. First down and 10, they'll go to the ground off left tackle. They'll find a little something here. By the way, good to see Tom Krieger is watching. He's uh, 
he's in the Krieger cave, I'm sure, with all his screens work hard. And then I came into the family, and I don't eat regular beef, much less beef heart. <laughs> Second down and four, they pick up six on first down. And Bartholomew will look to throw. Going to throw this one over. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. Got it. Way to the receiver. The receiver slows down to bring the defender in. And then Kaysen Jenkins with a little burst to create separation. That's pretty. Yeah. A little stutter step to trick a center. He, he's a player. Yeah, he is on both, both sides of the field. Handoff off left tackle and only a couple of yards and with about three minutes to go, a key third down coming up. What time do you go, what about, the, who's that guy? Yeah, so you're watching film on somebody, it's like, well, this guy's been all over the table. Yeah. Third down and eight. Bartholomew rolls left. He is in trouble, but makes a nice move and will bring up a fourth down and a very yeah. manageable two. And I would... Fourth and six, wide side is the near side. They'll go this way. He's in Ooh. trouble, going to be buried. And, and there he again. is again. There he is again. All over the place. I mean, they literally can't slow him down. If you're playing against an air raid offense, you'll turn it down. They'll bring pressure, and McIntyre throws this one out. Look out here. Ooh. Oh, the football cut loose. Did he get on it? I think he did. The Catholic does not have a timeout. 1-13. We literally were a minute in, and it was tied at seven after two 80-yard touchdowns. They'll go to the ground right up the gut and pick up a quick 11 yards and a first down. In Jefferson City. Joe yeah. saying they're open. I was told they were cool. I think a big drive here for Catholic as GMAC throws this one out for a first down because the last thing you want to do against this kind of quarterback and off, it just needs to participate. Second down at 11. GMAC has time, swings it out, open field tackle. That's nice. Dominic Dadabu. Great open field tackle in space. Yeah, I'm so impressed with you, Eric, that you've got that name down. Eric, is, uh, Austin's not even tried it. Down eight points. Say it fast and hope no one notices. <laughs> McIntyre has time, takes him a deep shot. Good Receiver throw. is there, makes the catch, and that's why George McIntyre is who he is. What a throw. I mean, you're just putting that right. And that was the one where you're like, okay, he can make that throw. That throw right there was kind of the equivalent to me. That's a long throw. Was it? It was thrown on time. Go, go, go. And, uh, Taking care of business. Second down and six. You're in field goal range for BA. May not matter as you'll inch closer a first down inside the 20. And still running, still pushing the pile down Man. inside the 10. Just physical, out physical the, the DB to get make it 10 or 11 yards. And ninth, uh, ninth play of the drive here, 23 yards on that one, literally 20 of it yard after the catch. Doesn't matter on this one, inside handoff touchdown. Six yards out, and there's that two-possession lead that we're talking about as Larry Sanders, the second, gets in the end zone in the first half. I mean, I, I know it sounds simplistic, and I get it, but, I mean, your best offense is throwing down the field specifically to seven or 16. I'm getting it in the hands of Tyree King, my best player. And a nice job coming up with that, and the defense all over it. Going to put pressure in the backfield and send Bartholomew down to the turf at the 11. That's Luke Robeson. That's BA's, uh, BA's second sack of the night. Bartholomew looking to throw, gets pressured again. And the contact made outside the end zone, so they'll mark this one at the three. And speaking of the snowball, rolls dance cheer spotlight as George McIntyre rolls to the right, looks into the end zone, touchdown. Easy. 
just that easily rolls to the right and finds Wilkes Eaton for the 23-yard touchdown. And just that quickly, B.A. has broken this one wide open. Yeah, George McIntyre's made a habit of throwing off platform and making it look just so easy in this football game. Here's another one. Simple bootleg action right here. Little play action pass continues to roll. Throws on the run. Receiver gets that's open. A, that's a heck of a throw. Yeah, it is. Um, one play, 23 yards. George McIntyre, very likely the exterior home solutions six-star MVP. Unless something changes. And this one is returnable. Uh-oh. From inside the five, Tyree King right uh -oh. up the middle. Really big lead here at 35-13. King, the man in motion. Bartholomew feeling pressure, throws this one out. It's intercepted, and look out here. Down the sideline, cutting back inside, looking for the end zone. Down inside the five, and there he is again. It's Keyshawn Bowman having himself a game. Yeah, and I'm all for George McIntyre being the MVP. He deserves it, but so does that young man. He has been everywhere offensively, defensively, and this interception here taking it down to around the five-yard line. Just stepped right in front of it. The pressure coming off the front side. In the last two possessions, you got it on the 20-ish, and now here on the four, or on the two, excuse me. McIntyre will hand off off right tackle, touchdown. Literally a touch right up the middle, and his second touchdown of the night for running out Larry Sanders, the second. Think about going for two here. They won't. On here. I'm not sure how a one-play, two-yard drive last 26 seconds, but somehow it did. It did not look good. This one returnable. Look out here. This one returnable, getting the block and nice field position out to about the put the uh, question marks. Oh, oh and here's good another grief. One. Good grief! Absolutely thrown right to the defender. And the dam is absolutely broken as Luke Robeson goes in for the touchdown. Yeah, not a good sequence here for Catholic. Two throws, two interceptions. It's just the way that it is now. You don't know how long somebody's staying. You got NIL transfer portal and better Tennessee's, reload. Tennessee's loading up on the quarterbacks. Yeah, but the room's not quite so full. Yeah, but I mean, any of the premier programs are going to have big time guys. So, I mean, like, you know, it's, it's compete here, compete somewhere else. You're competing no matter what. I mean, it's and not like somebody's going to go, well, you're our only guy for the next Now that how they used to be. It's also not the worst idea to come in and get coached up by Josh Heifel playing quarterback. I agree with that as they run off left tackle for eight yards, but it's just so different. Here's my beef. I'm a solid. That's of change that's happened in the last couple of years, and it all happened at one time, AP, and I think that's what's the most difficult thing to grasp. Because I agree with a lot of what Mark said, but, you know, there are some things I like about what's happening right now, but all kind of snowball. I give you millions of dollars and it works. That, you know, BA's been able to run the ball like they have here, you know, with their backups in the game. I mean, not are all backups, but, you know, portion. I think it's amazing how we had a great game oh! going, and then it's like somebody just poked a hole in the balloon. Just yeah. That he was. Turned 21 last week. We we had a big we had a big shindig for his 21st birthday. Went to Waffle House. Got some scrambled eggs. So you, got, you got some chocolate milk. Uh, we did. Look at the nice pass. In the back of the end zone. Touchdown. There's the backup quarterback, the young Cruz Jenkins, as he finds his receiver in the back of the end zone, Eli Ferguson, sophomore to sophomore. Yeah, Eli Ferguson had a drop earlier in the game. Makes up for it here. Really nice throw from Jenkins. Great catch on the other end. Touchdown, Brentwood Academy. I still can't figure if anybody got the At 5.55 to go, Catholic with a handoff off right tackle. While we were away, we didn't want to slow him down at this point in the night. And Catholic takes it all the way for the touchdown. Matthew Rogers on an 80-yard touchdown. And it makes it 56-20 to 20 as the extra point is good with 5.55 to go. And I took a risk, okay? You did. That's more yes. than you guys. Hey, hey, this time of the year, you got to do that as well. <laughs> well. Tonight, or tonight, you're definitely going to pick Morristown West. You think so? Yeah. Okay. 
We'll see. Oh, look out oh, here. Wow. Look out here. Look out here. Oh, look out here. Oh, we haven't oh, fun yet. Oh, look at this. The kicker. Tackle. Come on. That's one of those times where you could have flipped it to your teammate. And, you know You know what I mean? I mean, he goes all the way back and makes the catch over his shoulder like he's playing center field. Gavin Menard. Right tackle, turn it into the D1 red zone. From Brentwood Academy. And it was seven all back in the first quarter. I was going to say they'll just keep handing off. To throw this one out to Eli Ferguson. Both teams at their church service on Sunday morning. And then we'll finish things up with Gibbs and Fulton before we head into the playoffs. Right up the middle, another touchdown, unless there's a flag. And it is a touchdown for B.A. Panthers on the next uh, however many region championships. If that's the case. From after that, uh, Brentwood Academy gets their first region win of the year and a big win. Catholic will go ahead and run a play. And the catch is made here. Last play of the game. They're going to turn it into a touchdown. Look at the hustle by 32. They're going to make a 78 yard touchdown. Yes, they are. 78 yard touchdown to finish this wild and crazy game for Catholic. Andy Watts happy that Ted Russell Ford F 150 has been driving across the screen all night long. And the over just hit. <laughs> Were we not already there at 83? I'm joking. <laughs> well, they gave him the extra point. They're not even going to kick it. They gave him seven points rather than six. So I guess it's a final of 63 to 26, although the scoreboard says 27 as Brentwood.